All right, I'm Sean here with my buddy Gus. That's right. Football University, talking QB competitions. We got Georgia. Got the Georgia Bulldogs, Jake Fromm versus Justin Fields. I got Fromm coming out early. What do you got? I mean, I, I got Fromm too. Um, obviously led them national championship last year. Kind of hard to argue that he would lose this job to someone coming in. But, I mean, Justin Fields is the number two prospect coming in, so... You never know, but that's, I think it's Fromm still. That's right. I do think Jake Fromm will hold on to this all spring and all summer, but Justin Fields is going to get time to get in that Georgia weight room, spring ball, summer, all that, to get some reps under his belt. And he's got to be that number two quarterback. They don't have the luxury of having Jacob Eason anymore. Eason has long gone to Washington, got no one really under those two top quarterbacks. I think Justin Fields brings a different dimension to the Georgia offense that they haven't had. You know, him being able to run the football, buy some more time, open it up. Justin Fields is a quarterback of the future for the Bulldogs. This time next year, we could be having the same discussion whether Jake Fromm is still the number one quarterback in Athens. Yeah, and I think we discussed this as well, but I think they're going to open up that playbook for Fromm, let him expand a little more, not just quick hitter hook routes, but really letting him kind of let loose a little bit more. Yeah, and if you don't want to let it loose, he's got a great tight end at Isaac Nada, you know, a 2016 U.S. Army All-American. It's going to be a three-year start for the Bulldogs. they got to replace some of the running game, but they got Swift. Who was another Army All-American, so, I mean, he's still got weapons there. I think he's going to shine this year. Bulldog fans, nothing to worry about. They're in good hands at the quarterback position.